Good morning, SBC. It's Tuesday morning, and it's a great day for us to be up and about the ministry of our Savior. Now, here in Hopkinsville, we're going to be engaged in sharing the gospel with those in our city and encouraging those in our county. Don't know where you're at, but I know that wherever you're at, God has a plan for your life today. Had a great opportunity yesterday to be able to sit down with a young man who's going to be baptized this Sunday at our church. He is coming out of the issue of addiction. Everybody has addictions of some kind, and as he comes out of his, he has chosen to give his heart and his life over to Christ. It doesn't mean he's not been in church before. It doesn't mean he hasn't heard the gospel before. What it means is he's reached a point where he knows his life isn't going to cut it on his own. He needs God. And so he has given his heart to Jesus through a simple prayer and a statement of confession. And he will follow that up by being baptized this Sunday to share with the world what God is doing in his heart. Now, I know some folks think it's way too easy just to say a prayer and be done. That's not really real. I'm telling you, if you got to meet this young man, you would see the difference that's in his life. He is energized. He is excited. He is anticipating the future. He knows it's not going to be easy. He knows it's not going to be simple, but he knows that now he has God on his side and God is going to work with him. And whatever trial comes, whatever test comes, he's going to know that God's hand has not abandoned him, but is holding him as he passes through. I can't tell you what joy it gives me to see a new believer in the faith. And I cannot express to you the joy you feel when you give your heart to Christ. What about you today, Hopkinsville? Have you come to that place where you have given your heart to Jesus Christ, handed yourself over completely to our Savior? What about you, SBC? Just because you're in the church doesn't mean you're in the family. Just because you go under a steeple doesn't mean that you are a part of God's children. Have you made the decision to give your heart and your soul to Jesus Christ? If you haven't, don't you think it's about time to seize the gift that his son died to offer to you. Make it a great day today, SBC, and share the gospel wherever you go. I look forward to catching up with you right here at Second Baptist.